Hello, I'm Chris Menard. Snagit 2021 came out two days ago, which was October 20th. I have been using Snagit for years. Snagit is a screen capture program from TechSmith. I not only have been using Snagit for years, I use Camtasia, which is what I'm using to record my videos for YouTube. But let's talk about Snagit. Two new features in 2021. Simplify has been improved, and I'm a huge fan of Simplify, so I'm going to show you Simplify. I'll also show you the other feature called Magnify. There are more new features in Snagit 2021, and I'm going to do those in other videos. So I'm going to just keep this video pretty short today. I already have Snagit Editor running. So here's what a Simplify will do. I need to do a screenshot, and it doesn't matter whether it's a web page, it doesn't matter whether it's an application like Excel or Word, I happen to be in Outlook. I need to do a screenshot and show my emails, and I don't want to have to blur out a bunch of emails, so I'm going to use the Simplify tool instead of blurring, but I want to spotlight this Microsoft Planner email right here, and it says you have tasks due today. I'm trying to explain to someone that Planner, if you don't do your tasks, you'll get an email notification about it. But you could use this for any item. So here we go. I'm going to pull up Snagit. By the way, I could have just pressed Print Screen to pull up Snagit and do this. But I'm actually going to pull up Snagit, the Capture program. I want to capture an image. Here's Capture. There's my Print Screen option I could have pressed. But here we go. Capture. One cool feature I love about Capture, if you notice, I've got those gold crosshairs running on my screen. If I wanted to capture the entire Outlook window, I could actually just click right now. Because if you notice, watch. That is picking up the ribbon. That is picking up this menu over here. That would pick up the entire Outlook window. So one, it's easy to capture a snag it. So that's a bonus tip. But I'm actually going to draw this time. So I'm going to select from Focused Inbox and Other. And I just need to capture this information. And that works right there. It throws it after you capture it into what's called the Snagit Editor. It says that up at the top. I have all these tools. There is Simplify. If you don't see Simplify, if you click More, you will see Simplify. I'm also going to show you Magnify today. And just to show you this, when I say that there are new features, help. What's new? I'm covering Simplify and I'm covering Magnify. So let me close that out. Here we go. Simplify. Over here to the right is a panel. It says Auto Simplify and it's off or on. If I wanted to manually simplify this, I could using these quick styles. In case you're wondering, where did it get these colors from? This color palette right here, which I'm going to show you today, it picks these colors up from my screenshot. So I actually did, an, I actually did two other screenshots. Again, just hitting print screen. Watch what happens to this color palette when I select my website. It is a different color palette to pick from. So then I've got these colors. Let's go do something that has the color red in it. So I went to Coca-Cola and look, it's picking up these colors. So that's where it's getting the colors from. I can manually do this because auto simplifies off. So watch this trick. I want to not show all these emails. So I could click this icon right here. This is so cool if you ask me. And just drag it over the emails like that. So you can clearly see that there's an email on each line there. I'm going to undo that. You can undo and snag it. I'm going to let snag it just do this itself. This is so cool. So I'm going to turn on auto simplify. And again, I want that Microsoft Planner email to end up being visible. I probably want the um, focus subject received to be visible. So is focused and other. So let's give this a shot. There it goes. It did the colors itself. And you're like, well, Chris, you need to see stuff. 
So here I go. I'm going to, instead of drawing, which I just did with that tool, I'm going to do a move. But now when I click move, this allows me to remove what's been done. The question is, well, how do you know what you want to see? That is why they have show original. There's Microsoft Planner. I have move selected. I'm just going to click, drag, delete, focused and other I do want to see along with that title header up there in Outlook. Turn off show original. I'll do that one more time. Show original. I guess I don't care if people see this over here. There we go. So now I'm showing someone a screenshot of Outlook without having to use blur all over the place, which I'm okay with blur, but sometimes it looks bad. So there's the simplify tool. If you don't like the color scheme it used, the color palette, you can easily just change it. You don't have to redo everything. And you can even make your own, by the way. Now, item number two is I want Microsoft Planner to stand out. So I've done the simplify. Now I want to do the magnify. So more magnify. What do you want to magnify? I want to magnify that it's from Microsoft Planner. So I'm going to just drag a rectangle around it. If you don't like the color of the rectangle, if you notice over here to the right, I could change that right there. That is the outline color. After you do that, I'm going to undo and do it one more time. One more time. Draw around it. Put your mouse right in the middle. And then where do you want it to be magnified? I could put it here in the top right. Pull it down a little bit to the bottom right. I can put it wherever I want to. I think I want to put it right here, right above the subject. There is a magnify for you. So those are two new features in Snagit 2021. If you have any questions, I'm going to continue to make Snagit videos. I use Snagit every day. Feel free to give me some comments. Also, feel free to subscribe. And again, the link below for my affiliate site for Camtasia, which I use to record with, and Snagit is down below. Have a wonderful day. Thank you.